What is going on ladies and gentlemen, it's your boy Wheelie and welcome back to another episode of the Pokemon Ultra Moon Wonderlock here on the channel. Okay you guys, uh, first off if you missed last episode make sure you look in the description down below. Um, there's an entire playlist, I know these have been sporadic and I'm about to explain like a main reason why I'm slowly just been drifting off of YouTube. Um, but yeah you guys. Make sure you check it out. Last episode, we took on a totem Pokemon. It was the totem dragon Pokemon, Komu Omo, I think. And we lost some mods. So we have some new members to show off today. But yeah, you guys, if you missed that episode, make sure you go look in the description down below. And if you enjoyed the episode, smash that like button um, and answer the comment question of the day. Now, Let's get right into, like, why my videos have been, like, longer and longer spread apart from each other. And I'm just going to make it pretty simple, you guys. And I'm not going to spend too much on this. Um, but uh, as you guys know, there is a new, like, law or new rule that's going to be coming into effect, um, which is the Copa, Copa rule, the FTC it's making a rule where YouTube now has to make sure like their things are child friendly. So if your video um, appears or it looks like it's going to be meant for kids, you can get fined if you don't uh, show it. Like uh, if you don't put it in your description or you don't click there's a check mark when you post the video saying it's for children. So basically, if you guys know when I started my YouTube channel, I started for like try to be kid friendly I didn't felt like who I am I am the type of person just likes to go all out talk and say whatever I want to say so I went away from kid friendly and I just stuck to you know playing Pokemon and being me and so a lot of my videos aren't kid friendly and I put that well I might put I'm gonna have to put that in my and because I have to go through all these videos, you guys, but I have to check and mark them. They're not kid friendly. But even then, if I don't, if I check that it's not kid friendly, and FTC looks at my videos, looks what I'm playing, and feels like it's kid friendly, I could get fined forty two thousand dollars. And I am not a big YouTuber. I can't afford that. Not even some of the big YouTubers probably don't want to afford that. Um. And money-wise, like, gaining money, like, I know I can make a kid friendly, it doesn't matter to me, because I don't make money off of YouTube, so, it's just, like, I don't want to conform to being nicey and not cursing, because that's not me, and it's just, like, really diminishing. So, recently, I've been streaming a lot more on Twitch, I'm gonna be moving my Pokemon stuff to Twitch as well, um... I've been streaming, I stream about five days a week, five to six days a week. So make sure you go follow me on Twitch because once this series is over, I'm going to be done on YouTube. Um, I don't want to get fined. That's like two years worth of mortgage payments that I am not able to afford. And so I just do, did, once I, like YouTube, I know it wasn't going to become big. I just did YouTube for fun. And people watched, people watched like I get get like new subscriber the past two months it, and it's just one but it's like someone that's enjoying my content and now I can't post because I'm scared of getting a fine even though I'm just a speck little speck in the YouTube world and Pokemon community it's still something where they I they see my video and I have it that's not child friendly but they deem it child friendly because of the content I'm playing I just can't I can't uh, take that chance. So, yeah. I'm sorry for those who have been stuck by me and have enjoyed my Pokemon videos. Again, follow me on Twitch. Um, right now, I, I'm uh, throughout the week, I play Overwatch. And then weekend, I play like I play Naruto and other games. So, um, I am more of a writer streamer because when I'm tired of one game, I'll switch to a different game um, to take a break from it. But, yeah. Um, again, follow me on Twitch. That will be linked down below. I was, again, I feel so bad that I'm not going to be posting as much or stop 
once it goes to full effect, which is January 1st, um, only because I can't take that risk and I'm having much more fun with Twitch. Um, I'm close to affiliate, just the closest I'd be being able to make money online than YouTube. So thank you so much, but we're not going to be dead baby downers right now. When that time comes, it will come. Today we have an episode and today we're moving on to try to save Nebby. And first, before we do, let's do a quick team recap because we have some new people to introduce. First, we have Trump the y Gumshoe with Super Fang, Crunch, Yawn, Thrash. Um, this is going to change once we have to face, uh, I think it's the, uh, well, I'll explain it once that episode comes. Uh, next up, we have Misty the Gyarados. Okay, I, just, I made a mistake, you guys. I've been, I'm really scared for not the battle coming up, but the battle after that. Uh, I, I haven't slept much, and I didn't sleep much because I couldn't sleep last night. I woke up early to record, and I'm going to stream um, before family come over for Thanksgiving. So much today, but yeah. Uh, I reached like level 64, and now Misty sometimes ignores my moves or does other moves. So we're over-leveled. Pokemon wise, I feel like it's necessary. I just, man, it's gonna be a rough couple of episodes. Uh, so Misty is starting not to listen because Misty's like, I'm too good for you. I'm too good for you. You, you, you can't handle this. But we'll we'll put Misty in check soon. Um, we'll put her in check soon. Even though I defeated a, a trail, anyways. But anyways, Misty here has Aqua Tail, Ice Fang, Crunch, and Dragon Dance. Next up, we have Phoenix. Oh man, I'm whew. we have Phoenix, the Talon Flame with Steel Wing, Flame Charge, Boost, Acrobatics. Then we have uh, Gandalf, the Alakazam with Recover, Psychic. Dazzling Gleam and Charge Beam. Uh, we, next up, we have the, another new member of the crew. We have Jelly, the Jellicent. I didn't know what to put as for Jellicent. I don't use this mod much, but it's pink. It's fluffy. And it's just, it's look at it. Look at it. It's like, it looks like if you press on it, it jiggle like Jelly. So I, I named it Jelly. Uh, and Jellicent here has Brine, Water Pulse, Recover, Absorb. And then finally, we have uh, Esmeralda, the slow bro with slack off, headbutt, water pulse, sidekick. Let me explain what's going on with the new members, you guys. So basically, my plan for the second bat boss battle with... God, I know it's the legendary Pokemon, but it's fused with Necrozma, like Mega Necrozma. I'm going to have this man with... Toxic and holding, like uh, I forgot what it's called, but basically you can stand one hit. So if he gets a uh, one hit shot, he will live. So we it gives us the ability to get 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 ourselves one toxic off, and then basically these are HP people like that. I hope takes more than one hit uh, for them to be able to just take the damage. And let the poison destroy Mega <laughs> Mega Necrozma, so we don't lose a lot of mods. Because that fight is the fight I am most definitely scared of. I I'm gonna be honest, you guys. It's the most scared of. Now I'm not gonna play any games this upcoming battle. I don't want to lose anybody. So let's move on up. This might be a short episode, might be a long episode. We will find out. I'm not doing both boss battles. I'm doing one today, the next one once I level up more. And you guys will probably say, oh no, we got another week to two weeks before the next episode. <laughs> Maybe, because I have Thanksgiving plans. Wheelie! 
Our history tells us that the Vast Pony Canyon Jail was the first fair trail ever to be held. You did a fine job clearing it, just as expected, really. You've cleared your seventh trail on the Lola's Island Challenge now. That's wonderful. You've pushed yourself beyond your limits and really became a great trainer, haven't you? And he could never have done it without you, Gyarados. Let me help you up real quick. I just, I just healed before I started recording because I've been training. Look at the two of you. I think it just might just work out. Now, I'm, no, I'm quite sure of it. The sun flew and the moon flew. If we sound both together. Let's go, Wheelie. Alright, let's get this over with. I, t I have a plan. I don't want to lose any mons. The last thing we need is lose Misty. But I feel like Misty's the best chance I have at doing a lot of damage quickly and lasting because it's 17 levels over what we're about to face. <coughs> Excuse me. I can feel the strong power of the moon. Nebby. Before I can return you back to your original form, I have to find my mother. I have to tell her. I have to tell her how I feel. And then we will find a way to stand against the Krasma together! The sun flute. It feels like it was made to fit my hand. I think I can play it. Let me guess. I'm a pro at the freaking moon flute. What's gonna happen when you and Lily play the flute at the hardly rate? Thank God that you're not liable to fall off. <coughs> Knowing me, that's something I'd probably be do. Will you blow the moon flute? Sure! It's not like I don't have a choice. I think we should wait until the moon has risen. Alright, I'm playing at night. But then, how would the sun moon work? Or the sun flute? The sun moon. Look at me play. Look at me play. I look like a goddamn pimp. Too fucking good. Oh, shit. Jesus. Where's Nebby in all this? Now let him out, god damn it. You you want him to help, but you don't let him out. Lunala. Let's get it. And we're not even done yet because he's about to get... Oh, wait. No spoilers for you guys. Nappy, thank goodness you're all right. Please don't ever do that again. You made me worry so much. And I've never imagined that sounding the flutes would give you so much power. Or let you evolve into the legendary Pokemon. Not in all of my readings. Never did I ever come across any hint that you would evolve into the legendary Pokemon. Please, Nunala. No. Nebby, please. I need to go to where my mother is. We want to protect the Lola, but there is no need for her to try to catch the crossbow all on her own. Now 
fucking fairy fall off the mother end. The goddamn my man Guzma. Big bad Guzma. That's the Guzma. Mother as well. The big bad man himself. You children, run away. That thing is a monster. <coughs> what you expect? Mother. That is Necrozma. The instant it woke, it flew into a rage and repelled ev- Oh, whoops. The instant it woke, it flew into a rage and repelled everything that came near it. Lily, run from this place. You can't do anything. I will protect her. To the rescue! You look like goddamn Batman. The Batman signal! <laughs> the back of fucking Necrozma looks like the Batman signal. Go Lunala, go! Oh my god. Jesus. Do, 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 do. Just the Kahuna walking everywhere. Wait, this disturbance. Look at this. A flying goddamn chimney. Oh, this one's a rare visitor. Perhaps you should leave this one to me. It's another one. Oh. Jump here as a guardian or just a battle. The other islands must sure be facing the same threat. Oh, I'm counting on you, my comrades. Are they gonna show every island? They are gonna show every island. Fermosa, Buzzwool. He's just like, what the fuck I gotta deal with? Wait, wasn't she with us? Alright. Alright, we get this done right here. We get it done right here. The Cosmo appeared. Alright, alright. I'm not even gonna play games. I'm just gonna go straight out offensive. Oh my god, dude. Come on, Misty. Please. Please. No! Come on, Misty. Come on, dude. Is this gonna one tap? No. Come on, Misty. You got this. Come on. Stop loafing around. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. I, f God. I forgot to get heals. We 
we got one try at this. One try. All right. Come on, you don't loaf around, please. For the love of God. Yes. All right. Oh, man. I gotta go get heals before we continue on. Obviously, this is this is where I'm gonna end the episode because next episode is gonna be a doozy. Cause this man just raged. He mad. You mad, bro? You mad, bro? Dude left the freaking darkness everywhere. The crop. Krasma, the one that wields the light to its will. It will steal off all of Olola's light. The Krasma wants to take back the light that it once lost. But what are we to do now? It seems to me like the beast, like the Krasma, will also suffer somehow. It seemed to hurt it. To be without its light. You would worry even for Necrozma. You are too kind, Lily. Far too kind. That is why you took Cosmox as well, isn't it? You foolish, sweet child. We will need your help. We need to be able to travel between worlds using the legendary Pokemon's power, just as you are able to do. You pursue much? And despite that, it's true that you're trying to take care of things in your own way. Should I praise your sense of responsibility as one charged with the protection of Pokemon, you egotistical woman? Please, Captain Fico, let leave it be. It is my subordinate says, sparring with you now will, ch will now will change nothing. And there is something I'm more interested in pursuing. Something I noticed during the battle just now. The cross has seemed distracted by you. By that Z power ring you wear. To be perfectly accurate. It seems to desire the light given off by that sparkling stone set within it. You mean it was the Z crystal? It's true. Willie has an awfully large number of Z crystals after coming so far in his... Island challenge. Yeah, that's true. Even more than the dumb captains, kahunas, and all who just focus on one type. It is not in our power to fight with Solgaleo, but we do borrow its power to travel through the ultra wormholes. You have shown us what you're capable of, though by summoning Lunana to this place, perhaps you could ride upon our Solgaleo. Yes. Just as you ride upon Pokemon in Alola. We call it the Ultra Warp Ride. If you hope to follow after the Krasma, you must make for the White white Warp Hole. If you enter any other Warp Hole, you'll find yourself in another world together. Anyways, you guys. We're going to end the episode there. Next episode. Uh... First of all, I've never... Hold on, let me... Before I forget. Am I able to, like, do the settings here? Options. Okay, that's not gonna work. I remember there's a way you could change it. We'll we'll see about that later. Uh, but yeah, next episode we take on Ultra Necrozma. It's gonna be a doozy. It's gonna be a real big doozy. I tell you that much. I tell you what. Um, we either lose it next, 
next episode or we continue on. Hopefully the plan I have set up works. But yeah, if you enjoyed the video, smash that like button down below. Um, I usually go and say subscribe if you're new, but I don't want people subscribing. I just want people to enjoy the videos um, before I go away. So yeah, again, thank you so much for watching. Again, if you enjoyed, smash that like button. Answer the comment question of the day. Follow me on Twitch. It's linked down below. Let's get ourselves to affiliate. And yeah, this is Willie. I'm heading out. Peace.